Hey yo guys, it's Ambler right here and today I'm going to help you out, right? I've looked across the internet and I can't find the answer to relocate games on Epic Games. You do a clean install on your computer, your hard drive dies, something like that, you've lost all your installed games, right? Well, no. If you back up uh, a certain games folder, you can then relocate them. Like on Steam, on Rockstar Launcher, on pretty much any other launcher, you can relocate your game. Epic, there's no option. But, if you just follow me, right? So, say, say you've installed Epic Games Launcher on your C drive, right? You go into your C drive, program data, Epic is there, okay? Now, if you've just done a clean install, uh, Epic won't be there until you install Epic Games Launcher. So install Epic Games Launcher, um, and there'll just be a basic one there. Your save game files won't be there. It'll just be, like, you'll have your library. You obviously have to purchase the game first. You'll have your library. It'll just be greyed out. You'll have no games installed. Okay, so say you've installed your games on drive D, E, F, whatever drive, and you've got the launcher on C. You can relocate all other drives from each other hard drive from one folder. If you back up your Epic folder before doing a clean install, before replacing your computer, whatever, if, if your hard drive dies and you've lost it, you've not made a backup, then I'm sorry, you've lost it. But right click, copy that and paste that folder into a different drive, into wh wherever you want, into a different hard drive than you're going to uh, clean. So that it'll, when you do a clean install, it'll only ever clean install your boot partition or your boot hard drive, which happens to be in the C drive. For me, it usually is a C drive by default, but it might not be. So put it on a different hard drive, put it on an external hard drive if you want. You can plug one in, put it on a, a USB stick. It's not a big file. So just as long as it's not on that hard drive, it's fine. So you've put it in here, let's say, right? And I did, just for backup purposes. I put it in here. It's only 52 meg, it's tiny. You can put it on a cloud storage if you want, like it, it won't take long to back up. Um, copy it out of the drive you've used to, to back it up. Put it back in your C drive. It'll be there, as I say, because you've installed the Epic Games launcher, but there'll be no data. Um, right click over it, paste, and choose to overwrite that folder. Once you've done that, go into Epic Games and all your games will be there. Okay? It'll it'll be bright, it won't be greyed out, you'll have all your games back, you didn't have to relocate any when you don't have the option on Epic Games, that's the annoying thing. I looked through forums and I couldn't find I couldn't find anything. So use that method and you'll be able to get your games back, but make sure you back up your data. If you don't, you're gonna have to install them games again from, from the start, which is annoying. But you know, just make sure you back up that one folder. Sorry, one thing. You won't be able to see program data. It's a hidden file, okay? Go to view uh, and tick the checkbox hidden items, right? The object or folder will then appear. I'll just show you. So uncheck the box. That's what you will see or relatively something like that. If you tick hidden items in the view menu, they are greyed out slightly, so you know it's a hidden item, plus it's just appeared. <laughs> uh, go into there, and there you go, there's your hidden items. All the save games are in this folder. If you enjoyed this video, please leave a like, subscribe if you're new, and I'll see you later. Bye.